Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Trish, and if you're new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and hit the bell notification so that you're notified whenever I upload new videos. I like to try out new beauty products or just do some different makeup looks, whatever suits my fancy. So today, as you notice, I already pretty much have a full face on, just not my eyes. I have been filming videos throughout the day. I'm trying new primers. I tried a few items from my BoxyCharm um, box that I got this month. So I will make sure that I link those videos throughout this video. That way you guys can check those out. You'll see them pop up at the top of the screen throughout the video. Today I thought I'm going to do just a little eye look using the Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson um, mini controversy palette. And I did this video last night and I didn't like it because I wound up going way over the top and it's very hard not to with this palette. And I wanted to do something a little bit more subtle. And whenever I use a Jeffree Star palette, there is just not going subtle with me. I go bright and bold and I don't know what, what happens to me, but I'm going to try to go subtle today. So <laughs> let's give this a try. Last night, I literally had, what did I have? I had pink and then purple and then blue or something. I don't remember, but it was crazy. And I'm not wanting that <laughs> look today. Um, <clears throat> so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in with a little bit of Expose. This is gonna be my base um, color, this little light pink one down here at the bottom. I've already primed my eyes with the Jeffree Star White um, Concealer. And I'm basically just putting that all underneath my eyebrow, all the way down. Because like I said, this is going to be a more subtle look. I have to keep telling myself that. I got to learn to do more subtle looks because I will literally spend an hour in the morning on my makeup and go to work when I could do a little bit more of a subtle look and spend 20 minutes, you know, like I need to, I need to do a better job at that. Like there's people that go to work just like this. Okay. Why can't I do that? Um, now I'm going to go in with the controversy, which is that really deep purple, but I'm going to go one tap there and then we're going back into that exposed color. And that's where we're gonna go in the crease. And we'll just build up ever so slightly, going back and forth. Cause like I said, we're not going overboard. So that was a little bit darker than what I wanted, so I went back and went that light pink, that exposed. We're just kind of going over it a little bit because I want to make it a little bit more subtle. Now let's go into this crease. Jeffrey has such a nice formula. All right, guys. Very pretty. <clears throat> so for the actual lid of the eye, we're just going to go in with the My Boyfriend's Purse, which is this nice little um, champagne color. And for that one, I'm just going to get a nice little flat brush, which I'm going to grab my Jeffree Star S11. And we're going to grab some of that. This is a really soft shade, just so y'all know.
I've heard from a lot of people that they're scared to buy Jeffree's makeup just because of the bright colors, but you honestly can tone them down. You don't have to go over the top just because you see a lot of people wear them that way. I mean, hello, I'm one of them, but you don't have to. I had a little bit of fallout right there. That's because this shade is so soft. Okay. Look how pretty that is. All right, guys. Very nice. I am going to smoke out the lower lash line a little bit. <clears throat> and I'm going to go in just with a little blending brush. And we're going to go back and forth between those two controversy and exposed shades. Now, why couldn't I do this last night? Like, last night, I just went, whoo. like, my eyeshadow was, like, out to here. Like, it was, I look like bubblegum. That's what I look like. I look like bubblegum last night. Like, it was crazy. Um, okay, so let's add some liner. And I'm just going to add some liquid liner. Let's go for a purple lower lash line. This is the Ultra Soft Eyeliner number two by Santi. I don't know where I got this. sharpened for sure <laughs> and let's grab let's do a different mascara just because I know y'all are like Trish you always use the same mascara <clears throat> and we'll go in with benefit roller lash it's an oldie but goodie All right, <clears throat> now, since I'm not really sure where I got that eyeliner at, just so you guys know, um, it's kind of similar, but there is, um, LA Girl has a Gel Glide Purple liner too. I also have that one. It's a little bit different in color, but it's purple and they're really good. I really like their Gel Glides. But here is the eye look today. Make sure you check out um, my video on the two primers that I'm testing out. I'm kind of comparing them. So, um, and if you're curious, they are the e.l.f. the putty primer, which everybody loves, and the new e.l.f. matte putty primer. And then I tested out the Wonder Trip for Two Blush and Bronzer Duo with the Too Faced, uh, what is this, the Canary Diamond Light Highlighter, and this liquid lipstick by Mana that came in my boxy charm. So all those videos will be linked up above. So I will see you all next time and thank you all for coming and hanging out with me. Thanks. Bye.